Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Brave Software, who are the makers and developers of the Brave web browser, as many of you may know, has recently announced that if you are using the Brave search engine, that Brave search has now achieved 100% total independence. Now, what that basically means, in case you're unaware, according to Brave, they say now that every web search result seen in Brave search is now served by their own index which means they've removed all search API calls to Bing, which is Microsoft Bing, which previously represented about 7% of query results. So basically, in a nutshell, previously 7% of your search results had to call upon the help of Microsoft Bing, which is no longer the case. Now, a quick uh, history regarding a Brave Search, which I have been covering on the channel um, since it did roll out in June of 2021. And in regards to the rollout back then, um, Brave says that about 13% of the queries required the help of third parties to achieve the desired level of quality across various types of queries. Because back then in June of 2021, um, as I posted, Brave search was in beta, so it was in preview. And that's no longer the case. And Brave now um, is obviously its own stable independent search engine. And Brave carries on to say that total independence, however, was one of their primary goals and in less than a year and um, basically they have risen from 87 percent to 93 percent um when it comes to the brave search global independence score which rose from 87 to 93 percent now and um, brave carries on to say um that they were able to achieve these improvements in a few ways and the first is that um the rapid adoption of brave search made it the fastest growing search engine since Bing. So I don't know if you've picked it up, but I think there's a bit of a browser war going on here. And Brave obviously is now trying to so-called declare their independence. And that's because they say it's now averaging about 22 million queries per day. And secondly, um, they say uh, the broad adoption of the web discovery project, which allowed users to anonymously contribute browsing data to grow the Brave search index meant um, that obviously they could get feedback regarding privacy and quality from their different users. So that's why they were able to achieve these improvements in such a short time. And the long and the short of all this is basically, in a nutshell, um, Brave Search now is 100% independent, which means by default now, uh, Brave Search users will now receive 100% of their results from the Brave Index, uh, giving users fully independent results. And obviously, previously, that was not the case where they uh, relied on Microsoft Bing. And to some extent, though, um, they do still rely a little bit on Google. But nonetheless, just letting you know and keeping you up to speed if you do use the Brave search engine. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.